LeBron James has jumped ship from Coca-Cola to PepsiCo, and he will be the new face wow. of Mountain Dew. Is that a big deal? I'm it's so- not a big deal. It's surprising to me, though. When was the last time we heard of a celebrity endorsement switch between those two specific companies? That's big. Oh, that's actually the next story. <laughs> oh, there, there's someone else that did it. The next story is around a switch from two very big companies. Really? But let's, oh, Justin but, Long. But let's start with this one. Let's start with this one real uh, quick. That's so funny. Did you did you specifically choose the order of these? Uh, to go it from... Was, it was, it oh, wasn't it just, a tremendous it amount of thought. Um, I, actually, the Justin Long one, we talked about it on yesterday's episode. Okay. So I didn't know if I was going to bring it up, but I just, I want to get your take on it yeah, because yeah. I was so conflicted. Like the, 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 the way we were having to dance to discuss it, like it just, it, it's just a weird. I don't need to dance. I'll, I'll rip into it, but man. Like when I, we get there. I mean, I don't, I, you don't, I, we, I didn't need to dance either. Oh, right. I was just, it's just a, it's more complicated, I think, than it, than it, than it might seem on the surface. Sure. That's all I'm saying about okay. it. Okay. But anyway, go back to the to LeBron. Let's go to LeBron. So, I have a few questions about this one. Uh, these are huge, obviously huge brands, right? Uh, Pe- Pe- Pepsi had a big presence, obviously at the Super Bowl. They always do. They had mm-hmm. the the halftime show. Coca Cola opted to not have a commercial at all, which I think is the first time in a very long time. They've skipped it. Yeah. Normally, they would have they let Pepsi have the halftime show, but then they have a big commercial mm-hmm. to remind you they exist. Yeah. So Coca Cola not doing that, and now also not re upping and paying paying LeBron, indicates to me that Coca Cola may not be super interested in marketing the way that it previously has. Mm. See, I don't know how these, effective this kind of marketing is. I don't have de- I don't have metrics or well, right. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe you've looked into it. I've never even looked into to, I, to, to I, this stuff. I mean, this is this this stuff is like Google Trends. Like we yeah. have to look at bigger trends okay. to figure out if any of this matters. Uh, like, does Pepsi go up around Super Bowl? I presume it does a little bit. People were probably because the weekend did a performance and Pepsi's name was all over it. How much I don't know. Like we're in such a weird world. Where do you have a preference between those two? If, if you had, to I drink? would drink Coca Cola if I had it. Right. But I don't drink those at all anymore. Sure. And and that's what I was trying to get to. Okay. Is that are we at a point where these brands are so diversified and so aware of the fact that consumption habits have changed? Yeah. That they don't. If you're Coca Cola, you're like, look, we're selling Dasani water now. Right. Or. I don't know that Perrier you're drinking. Who whose product is that? Is that Pepsi Coke? But you know what I'm saying, right? They have their own carbon. They have it's like so many new and sports drinks, and there's sure. so many sub brands that might actually be taking more of a focus because I have looked at the numbers, at least as far as consumption habits are concerned. Okay, and both Coca Cola and Pepsi are not what they used to be. They're they've both declined. Declined absolutely. The fastest growing parts of their business are water water products. Wow. Well, have, has your consumption habit not changed? When I was a kid, I had a Coca-Cola all the time. I never drank pop a lot. Oh, ever? It was a treat for me. Okay. I still like it, right? Sure. I drink, I drink Coke Zero. Oh, okay. Like, I'll buy it. How often? There's some in the every, fridge every pretty day? regularly. No. Oh, okay. No. All right. But there's Coke, but my wife is not a Pepsi consumer. I can go either way. I don't really care enough. Oh, okay. But I'm just saying that I feel like people's, people's preference was baked in a long time ago. Mm. And the presence of LeBron or not doesn't really change that. Yeah, well, I've seen a. Uh, I actually watched a documentary on the origin and combat of both of these brands. They used to okay. be just straight up vicious about it. it would really? Be, well, it would be like the taste test, the famous Pepsi oh, yeah. campaign. They just put people in the street, like, which one you like better? Go ahead. Right. And it would be Pepsi or something. And then Coke would do another ad where they mimic or mock the original test and say <laughs> it was scammed. And it was just like the. the, the okay. The. the uh, mechanics of the of the conflict have gone on and so a lot of this is just uh bragging rights right right? some executive we got lebron james right and 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 who had him before oh coke did okay sweet right got him now you know type of thing but he has actually been with coca-cola i didn't even know oh i I, I knew that i knew that because because it was sprite you don't remember all the sprite campaigns with lebron with lebron interesting like if i had to associate him with a drink it wouldn't have been Coke or Sprite. You don't Sprite. remember that ad oh, campaign? Oh, I do with the red bottle. Yeah. Which one with the red bottle? Which one are you talking Is about? Is that the thing right there? Sprite's 
This oh, thing. Oh, I don't remember that I've bottle. Seen this. But that ad campaign over there, he 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 says, uh, "How does it go?" I don't, I don't always drink. Ugh, I'm forgetting now. Want a sprite? Anyway, you've uh, whatever. It's it's an ad campaign for yeah. a sprite. He looks very thin right there, by the way. Yeah. Anyway, he looks- uh, so he goes to Pepsi, and then Pepsi moves him. He does not market Pepsi itself. He markets Mountain Dew, right? Which is a Pepsi product, which is their Sprite, which is kind no, of no, no. They have Seven Up. Never mind. They have Seven Up, but yeah. it's it's probably they probably looked at some numbers and realized, okay, uh, the uh, those that would be influenced by LeBron, the Mountain Dew, are a Mountain choice. Dew drinkers. Uh, whatever, it's an age location thing. Sure. Uh, but anyway, whatever. Shout out to LeBron. I bet he got paid a couple bucks. Yeah, I for sure. 10, 20 bucks. <laughs> Some along 